All right, welcome. Welcome to Projector Success Secrets. So I'm really glad that you're here. And what I'm going to do is present for you a presentation that has comprised all of the best tips and tricks that I can give you right now to help you understand what a projector is, what we are as far as in relational context to the world, and then also some of the top success secrets that I know of that I can impart to you so that you can understand or comprehend how you're here to be successful in this world. And then I'm also going to invite you, if you would like to stay and learn about the pro program that I have for you to address all of the problems that we face as projectors so that you have growth in your life. And I do have a special offer at the end of this class. And welcome to the human design system. It's called the science of differentiation because it helps you understand how you're here to be different. You're not the same as everybody else. And particularly those of us projectors, we call them advisors in the career and business application of the human design system. We're not here to do all the doing and to manifest everything. We need to work in partnership. Ideally, in teams of one on one so a partnership or some of us have an ability to hold space for a group of individuals we can lead individuals in small groups or large groups depending on our design so I'll show you some of the applications of that in this program which this is the live open house for I like to take you through an awakening success secret experience. So it's not just about living your design. This is specifically for projectors. So it's about living your projector design so that I can help impart to you all of the secrets. And interestingly enough, the sun is in uh, gate 13, which is about listening to the secrets of others. I've heard a lot of secrets in my life. I have the other side of the channel and I'm here to share with you what I remember. In sharing with you what I remember from the actual experiential road of having been in human design for eight years now, not only that, but since 2014, specializing in awakening projectors, I have a lot of experience that I can share with you in learning the practical application of how to use this system in your life. You probably, if you're learning this, want to know how does it work, why does it work, how can it help me be more successful, and that's exactly what we're going to do in this program. So again, I'm Lavina. Hi. I'm an international human design schooled professional teacher. Ha, that's funny. I said schooled. True. I did go to that school. I've also gone to school at Human Design America. I've done everything on Jovian Archive. I've worked with Jovian Archive for many years now, since 2014. So I'm the co-author of that ebook that you find on jovianarchive.com because I'm a co-author, a writer for also mybodygraph.com, the International Human Design School, ihgsschool.com, and the BG5 Business Institute. So I've worked with these people professionally since 2014, 2016 so for the BG5 Business Institute. I'm a teacher of the human design system. You can see that I teach Living Your Design, which is the program that you're at. I'm also a, a teacher trainer of Living Your Design. So I train other people how to do this program. And as an analyst, I'm certified to be able to do partnership, life cycle, individual rave, and incarnation cross analysis. I also teach the continuing education programs for the Human Design Foundations, Rave ABCs, Rave Cartography, and I am also a small business analyst and engineer and just started teaching again the BG5 foundations as well, which is basically taking human design and applying it to career and work. So I have a lot of experience on my plate with actually using the system with individuals as clients, as students, and also with businesses and corporations and teams. So if you're an entrepreneur, you're in the right place, especially if you're a projector attempting to be an entrepreneur. It really helps to know your stuff in human design so that you know how to treat other people on your team or in your employ. Now, in this program, my primary operative is to invite you into the experiment of human design, of living your human design. And that requires that you learn how to use your strategy, your projector strategy, use your authority to make decisions, your own personal decision-making strategy for your decision-making process, and actually guide you through the experience. So it usually takes projectors much longer to get to a place of empowerment. Why? Because our strategy is not for the little things. It's for the big things in life. And those big things in life, what to do for work, where to go to live, who to love, who to bond with, does not come along every day. So you need some coaching or guidance as you go through this process as a projector. 
six months is usually about the time frame where you start to really see how it works in your life. So if you're brand new to human design, give it some time. It does take some time to get to that place of empowerment, particularly if you're very open in your design and you're very bitter in your life experience. If you're bitter right now, don't worry, there's hope. Hope is on the way. Help is on the way because you can change your fate. Hi. I have changed my fate with this experience of living my design because of before human design, it was in a very, very different place. Suicidal ideation, having all kinds of work and relationship issues. And now I couldn't be happier with who I am and the love of myself. That's the biggest key for human design. What it can do for you is help you love who you are, who you are for others in the projector context so that you can have the success that you so richly deserve. It is about success. When you are living in alignment, you have, you exude this aura of success. And for me, it's a contagion. It affects everybody that's around me. That's what I'm here for. That's my life's work is about changing your fate. So when we're going through our process of recognizing how are you going to change your fate? The one most important thing I want you to remember is your decision-making strategy. So we're going to talk about the um, strategy, how you make decisions today. And as far as your individual authority, that's going to take some time. And there's a lot of different authorities that we have as projectors, as you can see here, the solar plexus, your emotional intelligence, the splenic center, which is your survival instincts, the ego or heart, which is your willpower function, the identity and direction. We call that the G center in human design or your conceptualization process in context with hearing yourself sounding board that um, conceptualization process out with multiple others in your life. So these different kinds of projectors have different ways of sourcing into their body for their authority. And that is what is going to help you change your fate. So that's a big part of this program to make sure that you are very clear on what your authority is like, how it shows up for you, how it's designed to have its influence or guidance in the world, how it shows up for you. Okay, so welcome to all projectors. If you're a projector, you're in the right place. This is specifically for projectors. If you're not a projector, maybe you have a projector romance, you know, romantic partner or a work partner or you have children or you have parents. This particular presentation is also going to help you understand them 